started uh, as a biology major, uh, undergraduate biology major in general biology. After graduating from college, I went on to the Albany Medical College in the microbiology and immunology department, uh, where I received my PhD degree. Following, and my thesis research uh, at the time dealt with the effects of heavy metals, lead and mercury on the immune system and on the immune response. So I had started in uh, graduate school uh, uh, hoping to study immunology and cellular immunology and immune mechanisms and uh, right from the very beginning uh, got into this uh, uh, field of what we call immunotoxicology, uh, using these metals as tools uh, to provoke changes in the immune response and, and, and study them both from the perspective of the immune system as well as uh, the relevance to toxicology issues. Following graduate school, I went uh, over to Sweden, to the country of Sweden, in the Karolinska Institute in Stockholm, Sweden, uh, where I studied uh, cellular mechanisms of cell death, uh, studying apoptotic and necrotic signaling pathways. And after completing my postdoctoral period after two years, came back to the United States and began uh, my career uh, in academia uh, at two different uh, uh, institutions. First at Wayne State University in Detroit, uh, and then followed where I was for seven or eight years, following which uh, I went on to the University of Rochester Department of Environmental Medicine. The, the basis of my research uh, has largely been uh, um, um, one of uh, studying mechanisms of metal-induced changes in the immune system, uh, with uh, connections or studying how this is relevant to various immune-mediated diseases. Mm -hmm.